So a warm welcome to you all. We will be underway very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. And here we have Paris Saint-Germain against Saint-Étienne. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Well, thank you very much, Mr Drury, and hello to everyone. The lineups we've just been given. Defence really needs to have that closed down. They were able to get the centre in far too easily. Marco Verratti. Kozawa. Cavani. Rue. Chip through. The referee's awarded a free kick. Played out to the right. It was a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. And it's Neymar. It's the route one option. Pogba. Decent early chances. It bodes well for an exciting game. Saive. There's a look to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. Now it's Saive. Looks like a good ball through. Neymar with a shot! Great ball to play him in, but he will be gutted to miss that. And it just goes to show you how effective those through balls can be. All it needed was a better execution. It's a long forward pass. Now it's Cavani, looks to slip it through. Saved only by poor finishing. Probably not his best option. I think goalkeepers are, are normally happy for players to have a, a go from them. It so nearly came off for him. I would agree. Uh, it's tremendous play. He's full of belief and imagination and hard to contain. Draxler. He's in! Saint-Germain take the lead. Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal.
Paris Saint-Germain. Draw first blood here. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Well, that's where he wants it. Well positioned to make that interception. Wu with the ball through. He's made certain that won't get through. For story. Balls come loose and the chase is on. Now it's Lucas Mora. Lucas Mora with a beautifully timed run. Now it's Saive. Tries a through ball. Daniel Alves. So they got the only goal to give them a 1 0 lead. Lucas Moura. He scores! All too easy. They are in danger of disappearing out of sight. <laughs> the purest possible contact. What a fabulous strike. Is it just me or did he make that look very, very easy? That was terrific skill and composure from him. He finished with such a plumb. Paris Saint-Germain get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. defence as well I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence I think you know any good team really your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do tries to get it forward quickly for story now it's Lucas Moura. Lucas Moura passes it through. And more, and more, and more. Hot knife through butter. They have done it again. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Yeah, it tempted and teased the keeper into thinking he could get to it, but it just eased the way to catch the inside of the post. Paris Saint-Germain take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Neymar. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? In for the follow-up, and he's poked it home! And already they're looking to run away with it. He was so alert to the possibilities there, great stuff. Well, for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. It's fantastic. Paris Saint-Germain tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Draxler. The referee brings the first half to a close. Paris Saint-Germain have been simply outstanding in the first half. There doesn't seem to be a single weakness in their team. And should that not change, they could go big from here. Paris Saint-Germain pretty much out of sight here. It really has been a one-sided game so far. Kozawa does well to read it and intercepts. Thiago Silva. Draxler. Pastore. Now the pass.
pumps it upfield. Now it's Saive. Decent ball. Not the worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Saint Etienne have a free kick. And he's going to have his name taken. Players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. Saime! And that is quite wonderful! Oh, that is a gem! Unbelievable. Oh, that is a bit special. <laughs> Saint Etienne have a goal, but it's hard to see it as anything much more than a consolation. Looks to slip it through. There to hoof it away. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Verratti! It's come out to him and no mistake! Results no longer in doubt. It's just about how many. Ruffier reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. But that's one of the first things you learn, whether you're a striker or not. Just anticipate a goalkeeping parry or spillage, and sometimes you'll get lucky, it'll come your way. Paris Saint-Germain totally rampant here. Catherine plays it out to the flank. Thiago Silva. Pastore, Draxler, Draxler, and that's surely a foul free kick. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Chance here, what can they make of it? Paris Saint-Germain looking to widen the gap even further here. Oh, almost a sixth! Neymar is being picked on here. Yeah, and the fact that he's registered, Peter, simply encourages more attention of, um, of a, a closer nature. Now it's Saive. That's good defence. Uh, plain and simple, good defence. They refuse to allow a turn. Saint-Germain to make a change here. Draxler hoops it upfield. Cavani brings the ball forward. Chance! Aimed long and direct. Long and high towards the flank. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. I timed this run brilliantly, and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then, and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind it was needed. Neymar, now it's Neymar. Shade too heavy, people can pick that up. And it's Saive. Now it's Rue. Cornier. 
can he score? He's put it wide. Marco Verratti. Draxler. Clears it out of harm's way. Katerine did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Gets it back, pushes it out wide. Kozawa with the ball through. Oh, good stop, it had to be. Without the best in the keeper. And the header! Boots it to safety. Jackson. Goes for it. Oh, denied at the last. Oh, that's great stuff from him. Well, he went at it with great confidence, and it's not going to stop from trying again. Looks to thread it through. Marco Verratti. Who's going to make this theirs? There is the final whistle. A demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Paris Saint-Germain have some very strong runners from midfield, and it's not often you'll see a team be so effective by advancing through the middle like that, but this was very impressive, the way they cut through the heart of that defence.